very good evening to you. Welcome to Y254 Chit Chat Show. And also a very happy new month to you. It's April 1st. It's also Fool's Day. Did you get fooled today? Would love to hear from you all those stories. You can talk to us on Y254 TV. We have a post on our Facebook page as well as our Twitter page. Talk to us. The hashtag is Chit Chat. Go comment below. Let us know where you're watching the show from and with who. And at the end of the show, we're going to be sending some love your way. Now, my name is Philin at Philin Jean across all socials. And of course, I don't do the show alone. I have my co host right here. I'm going to always start with our own very sassy JC, as I call her. Hi, guys. Sassy, you I not expect to introduce the new ones. Ladies, you may want attention before to answer. I'm going to walk up easily. 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 It's fine. Yeah. So, I hope you guys are well. I hope you're keeping safe. I hope you're keeping safe. I hope you're keeping safe. Yep, hivi, 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 hivi. Mm -hmm. Stay tuned, don't touch the dial. Yep. That's what's up. And then we have our own Ooh. headmaster. Hey, and he goes by the name. Do. <laughs> so you know, you know, you know. Yes. AKA the Mwangis. Have you been? What's up? Hey, Nashkuru Sana Maze, thanks for having me. And uh, watch any one be. I remember your fool's day. Tafadali, don't try me today. Tafadali, I Kenya. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, come up below what we are Wakati. Yeah, so in the Wakati, you can feature remote in the Fika, you can have a new one. And then we officially say that the room is, is officially, officially open. open. Yes. yes. Now, if you don't already know about us, if it's your first time tuning in, now we're all about gossip, yeah? We're all about trending topics, what your favorite celebrities have been up to. You're going to find it right here. We do a weekly roundup mm -hmm. starting right now. Mm -hmm. Now, let's start with our first story right here, where Kenyans in the entertainment, tourism, and hospitality industry are now calling upon President Uhuru Kenyatta to lift the recently imposed partial lockdown. Netizens took to social media to voice their grievances under the hashtag unlock our country country as they urged the uh, as they argued rather that the lockdown plus curfew and closure of entertainment joints and restriction of movement has rendered many people jobless just as they were starting to catch a breath from the first lockdown mm -hmm. now and just yesterday a section of kenyans took to streets to demand that the president unlocks the country let's have a look at the video I'm saying that because in the what are we supposed to do honestly? Kenyans, and we defend power, we defend it, we call them the super spreaders. Our bosses are in their houses, they're comfortable. We're the ones who work for them, they've locked the country for us. What are we supposed to do? International flights can still operate within the country, in and out of the red zone. What am I supposed to do as a normal Kenyan? In my own country. Well, that is as of yesterday, but as of today, we have new developments. Mse, Kwanza, what? Now, the president talked today, and I was just here in studio telling guys, Vile Ame to Fanya Ile Kitu. Ile Kitu. Same, same. Road, bumper to bumper, it's like this. So, we're like, you know what? Ii langata road, amte tuweza, sisi na bypass, Mombasa Road, Bado. To kind of, I'm sure, sure to what's up, Bunyala Road. I'm sure maybe some of you saw me somewhere. Apo kuna Ujanja, there is no way Unashuka Utembe. Me, I don't see Kwana George Kopi. Me, we're talking even on our two and Utembe. I'm like, what? Now, Munanda Pi, Tao, Twende. Just I'm keeping me at the Siju Niko. Siju, Lele Jamiko. There's no, we are not getting to town anytime soon, and we are already late. Say, show me 67. So, we have. I know. Do what you've got to do. Lakini, as much as uh, traffic was like upsetting and everything, but some good news came from yeah, that. Yeah, and see, mm -hmm. I think he was opening the expressway. Yeah, yeah he did yeah, that. Yeah, he was, yeah, that's he, he also opened the hospital here at Green Park. Yeah, yeah, yeah Green Park. That's where he was today. Nairobi. 
Kanero kuna traffic mse. Yaani ni vile unajua unaona back in the day before kafi ngambia mse usinde home sai we back it tao until ile my time mse enda home. Tafadhali go to live stream. Asmata kuna traffic live stream at time. Yeah and what Jesse said you can actually that's the good news you can actually take us with you y254.co.ke that's where you get us you can stream us live. You know? Yeah. All right. So, Jesse so, anatuambia kuna mm -hmm. good news. Nikipa kwa makeup. Yeah. So unajua hapo sound room hapo yeah. next. So he was addressing mm -hmm. the nation. Yeah. Um and uh, he said he will find a way yeah. to work with the people who are affected. Mhm. Mm and I really hope he does. We really hope that he finds a way to work with them because um okay, one thing hatukatai there is covid, it's real. Yes, it is. And we must Tulizita zinitwa mitigation measures. Yeah, I Containment did that. measures. Mitigation measures. I mm -hmm. did that in school, I remember. Guys, hata sasa ndio imekuja. I did that <laughs> in school. Mwalimu wa nini? Mwalimu wa tulisoma it's mm -hmm. a it's a pandemic strategy. Mm -hmm. So, and I never thought by the way tutaiongelea any time hapa. <laughs> Nakumbuka nikiwapea story ule mwalimu aliniambia mambo ya sima. Sima ya kwenda kusima umekumbuka fire station I was like sima I told you that time yeah. it was that time so uh, guys uh, we no matter how much we are affected no matter we need our lives together yeah and at the same time we need our sanity in terms of work mm -hmm. money you know pesa. pesa it controls us so if at all atatufungulia mnakumbuka tuliwaambia wachunge kusifungo Aki tufungulia, let's not go to the loose, let's not go to the extremes. Jua the end of yeah. the day, ata tuki demonstrate, ata tukifanya nini, aki tufungulia tutoe mask, COVID inendelea. Yeah. Alafu mnaogopa vaccine. Yeah. Kili msi tunaweza tumi platform kuambia watu waki, wakipata nini waenda wadungo. Yeah, if you have the opportunity. If you are you among the frontliners yeah. wenye wanapewa, you and go, you are above get, 58 years, yeah. wacheni kuogopa vaccine. We are doing this for the better. You guys, you, you still want us to kwea in another 2020? Ya kulive, ya no, I don't want that. Let, let's go get want, that vaccine, I want, I want, I want the, our country to be unlocked yeah, for things you know? to go back to normal. And we can only do that yeah. if we work together, yeah. not against each other. Exactly. You know, so, yeah. Wani mwalimu walimu wako kwa. Yeah, unajua teachers wao ndo wanakwangana zile mapoa. Ndio, eh? Wanakwangana wisdom, wisdom. Sio poa. Give us wisdom. Anyway, um uh, what I will say is uh, lockdown or not, the economy is recovering. Yeah. As we speak, we have already uh, revised the measures. Uh, mambo ya free transactions tumerudisha, hakuna free transactions. The economy is recovering. <laughs> Mafuta tunapandisha bei, we are recovering. So yes, thing <laughs> Really? Tafadhali. Really? Tuendelee na huo moyo wa kuendelea kusaidia nchi ita grow. But the thing is stay safe. Mm -hmm. Corona is real. If and Kagwe said this. Mm -hmm. Kama uja last year ulikuwa unasema hujui watu. Hii mwaka you have known somebody. Yeah. I have. Ama mtu unajua mtu. Personally I have. Mm. And it's and not a good experience. It's quite unfortunate. It's Even not. right now nimetoka like it's this not. from um, I was just talking with a friend of mine she just received a call. Yes. Her boss just lost this sister it's not to tragic. covid. She she had she had um this condition. She she had a a, a condition. Uh diabetes. She she was mm. diabetic diabetic. Yeah. yeah. Right. yeah. Yes. And then she passed away today. So that's what we're talking really about. Sad. As long as you have any pre-existing condition, it's very easy for you to get exposed. And once that's exposed, that's it. And we're seeing RIPs. You cannot pay Giaco anywhere. Instagram, Facebook, I love WhatsApp. Who, I love you know, who, RIPs. There's so many. Feeling people used to say me what were too old. Yeah. You know, they are no longer that. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Evo. What we're going to say me are the old people. No. What are you going to This wave in a two attack. See, see, go and say. Come on, I'm not sure. Evo. I do jokes. Like, uh, like as of last week, as of this week, I think I've seen two burials. Yeah. Yeah. Like twenty, twenty something year olds. And, and COVID. it's so sad. And uh, was say like young people is due to seme na sheng. Vile I wish ninge kuwa uwe omse ni onge ni wambie. Like due to najo isho mostly no nangwa na youth. Mm, right. You guys, ni nini tu nahitaji. Nili wambie last Thursday. Yeah. 80% of the Kenyan population is the youth. Ni the youth, yeah. So if you mess up, you're messing up the economy, the whole country, everything. Yeah. Included. It's going to take a very long time for, for us, us to recover. recover. Yeah. Alafu to kiku lose and then your pesa nyewe unalipa revenue tax. Yeah. Alafu nandina tuyenda. Yes. Let me tell yes. you something. It's a cycle. 
Yes. Let me let me just touch on something. Shere yendi anywhere. Like I was saying, piga. There was there's this <laughs> friend of mine who's who's like no no. He's hey. calling me up like yo, what's up? We're having a party. I'm like hey, you guys go party. I'm good. I'm okay. I'm, like for real. Like why you going to go party? Tu tu fifty years. Muna na muna jifungia mahali ati mwenye mudi. Where's the fun in that? I know. Like no, please. We, we're gonna drink. We're gonna party. We're gonna do karaoke. Exactly. We're gonna do everything you used to enjoy. When we are we safe recover. without the mask. Yes. Yeah. We imagine we'll later kuwa. But then at the same time, I also understand where people are coming from. Juanie watu me lose jobs. Yeah. You get? Yeah. It's serious. Because watu wa hospitality. Hospitality. What hotel you wanna jobs? Entertainment. DJs wanna jobs. Walo wa se club kwanza na kuanga si DJ tu kuna DJ kuna security mm. kuna mtu wa kuosha kuna hostess kuna yeah you see mm. how as your service mm. wa ku make sure you una mm. get drinks and stuff so those are a lot of people mm. and for hotels yeah the hotel industry as well kuna wale tourists kuna nini mm. Ad, like as much as uko Kenya mtu unda Mombasa unaenda wapi you can't right now yeah. this is like restriction of movements and everything so I just hope like we recover, but also at the same time we understand the reason why they had to do what was I'm, done. I'm not political, but I think I want to commend one person, Governor Motua. He yeah, did a good what job. he did. You did a Ooh, good job. I'm yeah. not political, but hey, Apo, hey, can you give us? Yeah, no, okay, I'm a chakos. We're going to do a post and do the Aulipi. Ah, um, say. Like there are so many things he did mm. for his people, but then like you know, Joa Machakos is not as big compared to Nairobi. Nairobi, what you know, you can't do that for everybody, though. You see what, what he did, eh? Let's he, be realistic. What he did, as yeah. much as he didn't, Izo Zingine is the government measures. Yeah. Mm. He got private sector into play and go supermarkets to reduce mm. prices. Yeah, that's the one thing that I think he worked hand in yeah. hand. Yeah. In Yo, as in, you walk into a supermarket with three Gs, you save five hundred bob. Mm. Where do you get that? Yeah. So, no one else so when you, you get that. out of the supermarket, you go get greens. Yes. Whatever. Get yeah. something else. Yeah. That's amazing, by the way. Yeah, serving. Kola, by the way, say we're serving. Say we're not going to eat. We're like we we we're not we're not super. We're not buy brand. No, we're not buying brands right now. What is the offer? Ini sabuni. Ini re sabuni. Mbone ini so. Na ini seventy. Nipai ya seventy. Let me bring you on the super. So just inakwanga katikati. Just inakwanga on offer. Hey, let me let me let me let me let me this may be me. Buy one, get one free. I at least take you on the expiry date. Turn the turn there. Just buy it. Hey, you may verify. To the top, guys. Anyway, anyway, we're gonna we're gonna move on to the next story right here. Yeah, where Radio Africa Group is counter suing Shafi Weru for 150 million Kenya shillings on what they termed as breach of contract. Now, this is in response to Shafi's lawsuit by his lawyers against Radio Africa Group, in which he demanded to be paid at least 21 million Kenya shillings in damages for what they called unlawful termination on Sunday. Day, Radio Africa fired its breakfast show presenters Shafi Weru, Neville, and DJ John Falme with immediate effect. The corporation is seeking compensation for loss of business and reputation damage occasioned by controversial statements made by Mr. Shafi uh, during the breakfast show that he hosted alongside Joe and Neville. Now, aside from Shafi Weru, former classic FM presenter Terry Muikamba is also suing the company for and demanding rather two million in compensation for unlawful termination. Extian Della on the other side said he also worked at Royal, uh, at a rather Radio Africa Group and the company has a toxic work environment and that's why he had to leave behind his salary of 300,000 300, Kenyan shillings. Yes, I don't know if you guys are getting can this. You, can you like, talk about mm, something? Yeah. Mm. Don't get so, positive. like Terry, actually, before even Shafi, Terry Mikambar, I've worked with Terry mm. hand in hand. Like, I've worked with her. She's a sweetheart. She's amazing. But then she came. Radio Africa for unlawful yeah. termination. Yeah. yeah. And and then she was like, uh, it was toxic. The boys were well, not nice. They used the like the language they use ku kuangala shawatu is not uh, it, it's, it's not professional. Yes. Yeah, exactly. So after Terry, just a day after Terry, Shafi comes through. Oh, CPM, I was fired. Yes. So Radio Africa after that they had to counter Shafi. Two million, you're like, oh well, 
Yeah, Shafi, you need 21 million plus. That's a lot of money. So the company is like, you know what? You also damaged our reputation. Our biggest sponsors are pulling out. So what are we doing? We're also suing you for you pay us 150 million. <laughs> so I really don't know. This story just took another day. It started very... We had this story here last week. Mm. Mm. It's about this chick mm. that was pushed over building from Trust. Mm. Mm. story chini chini. And then it came and just blew up in our faces. And then it became this major thing. That's why it's a drama. That's why I'm going to take a picture. Shafi, first they were suspended, I love after suspension, and then Radio Africa wakachajua one million because of that by CK. CK, yeah. After CK charged them, then the the bosses are like, you know what, this is a lot of damage. They have to do some sort of damage control. So they're like, We got rid of them, so you're fired, you're fired, you're fired. Shafi is like, you know what? Mimi ni ngizanga 685. 82. Oh, 680,000 per month. Mse, yeah? Uwe? Lens. Eh, lakini hems. 682,000 bob per month. Man. That guy makes 21,000 a day. Simple. In a siku. Kukua tu asubui tu. 21. Ukikuja tu, noja show ya radio ni 4 hours. So for 4 hours. Akituambia tu. Yeah, for 4 hours you've made. Akituambia, noja ya ni my mark guy, ni you guy my guy. What I'm saying is. You guy my moji, my moji. Yeah, ni you guy my guy. What I'm saying is, it's unfortunate that you go to such levels. Yeah. We didn't really have to get there. Honestly, there was no need. It was really an awful. As in, Tulifikapo to... And the worst part is, the people who made it get to that level, the moment it became low, were Leondokia. It is no longer them anymore. You guys made somebody get fired? That's not a problem. Now we are in a legal lawsuit because of such. 21, 150. Look at what we have done. Millions. See shillings. See 10 kilos. See shillings. See shillings. Millions. Yeah. How far can and, we so, go? Let, let, let's have a look at this. How do you guys think this thing is going to go? Shafi, the, like, is he going to drop? Who's okay. going to drop? Who's going to... In the out of court. Hazama, what? In the out of court automatically. What? He what settled settle down. In the out of court. Yeah. It's automatic like that. But I like one thing and I'm very supporting Shafi on something he did. Do not ever... And this is a, a, a message to guys out there. The more, or even anyone who's having an issue with your employer. The moment Kime Umana avoid social media at all cost. Yeah. See what he did? Mm. He and kwa koti. You just go to court and do not try to engage social media. Mm. Yeah. Right now, Shafi has a case that made Radio Africa panic. Mm. Honestly, that's panic. 150 million mm. is panic. Mm. Automatically, by then, you need panic. Because the thing is, if you read the suit or whatever the lawyers were demanding, by then, those guys were making sense. Mm. I'm, I'm still waiting to see the document that Radio Africa that. will present for 150 million. I still want to see their computation because Shafi's made sense. All there right. was a lot of calculations that. No, but that's a sense. whole corporation. I'm sure by the time they, they, they draft something like that. We would want to see their calculations too. To. But I don't think theirs is going to be on social media though. I don't think they're going to leak theirs. But at the same time, we're not commending whatsoever what Shafi and the team did. That was not, we're not vouching for that. Jason, Definitely, yes. We are, you, you're here, you as a lady. You see, like Definitely, as much yes. as like some people think they, like the whole being fired and everything was blown out of proportion. Too much. Because they already apologized. But thing is, when you have a platform like that, you're talking to masses. You're talking to so many people and you have to be careful of what you say. So for you going out there and call, saying women are loose and stuff like that, I don't think that was really nice. Emma, what do you have to say? Yeah, you remember you guys, I posted uh, the other day, a post, and I said, mm -hmm. let's not overlook the fact that they are, there are women who are making us to generalize you eh, mm -hmm. as bad. Yeah. Let's not overlook that. Whether we like it or not, it is there, it is happening. Unakumbuka tulikuwa tuna have conversation na wepale unanuliza masoli mpaku unashtuka. Like the things that girls out here are doing, to see cover up na ule mtumu innocent like her, Eunice, the way, she's Eunice, right? That Chile, she was Eunice, I think. Uyo mwenyali rushwa. What they did was wrong. But I think the way they said it and the platform they used, that was totally wrong. And um, they apologized, but sasa imekua ime blow out of proportion. It's, it's, I think this drama, sasa, niao, ikua behind the scenes. Juwan, our just said, dear, that, that girl who is the victim, exactly. it's not helping her. It was not for them. Kukua on a trend Twitter Monday to Monday. Mm -hmm. It was for 
advocating for the rights of a girl who was allegedly thrown out of a building. Una get? It can trickle down to some kufungua biashara zao, kufanya. Do you know you guys at the end of the day, kila mtu mtu wako anajua homba is amejua. Mnajua hivyo? Yeah. 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 There's pa negative publicity. For yeah. them it's working. And I'm telling you if it's working for them, it yeah. doesn't move. So and that's why that is what it does. And that's why it's actually taking a different time. Exactly. There's someone who's actually on social media saying the owner of the, the owner of the office so allegedly. We don't know if that is actually true. Or if yeah. It's just someone who's trying to also exactly. ride on the wave. Yeah. We don't know how true that is. It could, it could be anyone. The guy, the guy, if the profile I went through, because I actually saw the whole statement, I would say he's a reputable guy in the in the industry he plays in. So. What are to seem discredit as of now? There's a lot of questions still unanswered in the situation yeah. that we're having now. But kindly, Mose, next time we're having such an issue out there, guys, whether it's gender or whatever we're having an issue with, let's never blow anything out of proportion. Okay, yeah, that's true. But also, at the same time, let's also be sensitive. On what we say. And what we say on air. And you comment. Given, this is a privilege. Mm. Like the moment you, you have a platform like that, it's a privilege. You're speaking for you're different addressing people. Almost you're addressing almost. You're speaking for air. And you're speaking for different people. Mm -hmm. Like if you, you take, to say me, I'm taking the side of the chick and you're taking the side of the Just guy. Just be sensitive. We are, represent, we are representing the majority. Pia una represent boy child. You get at the same time. So you have to be very careful with what you are saying. Because nobody's opinion yeah. is wrong. Iyo tuelewane. Now, kila mtu really, opinion ya kila mtu ni right. You don't know out of what you're saying, you don't know who you're influencing. Kuna mtu atena pigia mtu aseme denuali sema kupigia mtu ni sawa. Kwa hini simi ni mpigia ju denuali sema. Why do you think people are always calling radio to solve their marital issues? Because they think people on radio know better. Mm. Even though some of them are not You're even married. You're an icon. You know, they're not even married. You're they don't have icon. families. Mm. But people somehow look up to you. So I think people just really have to take care. But the drama now is too much. Yeah. Mm. All right, so. <laughs> to pay <laughs> another much. topic. It's too much. So we're going to move on to another, <laughs> another story. Now, 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 this is good news, right? Now, remember, hashtag chit chat. We on Facebook as well as Twitter. We have posts. Go comment below. We have posts. Go comment below. We have posts. <laughs> and as well as April Fools, man, it's first of April. Why are you fooled today? I'm only fool. I'm saying I can get a box. Me kid dog even in get a box. You may like not not like at least. Okay. Oh. 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 Okay. I know. Point is this. Point is this. We are on, on our socials. Why to fair? Add the Instagram. Yeah. Why to fair? Kila mahali go comment below. Just tell us your different opinions about the stories you're talking about and laugh. We're gonna be sending some shout outs. Mm, definitely. So, yeah, mm. Lazima. Mm. And on that note, we move on to another story where Karachi Brewery's hair is. Analisa Mwigai shared a video on her Instagram stories flaunting a growing baby bump. <laughs> now, Analisa and her Tanzanian husband Ben Paul got engaged in 2019 after dating for a few months and got married last year uh, at a secret wedding. Late last year, the two are rumored to have broken up after they unfollowed each other on social media, but it turned out to be false. However, we have a video. Let's have a look at that. Wait, turn your monitor. Like that just makes me so happy anyway. Like just you see, I love seeing people happy. Annalisa is legit very happy. You know, what you oh what are China, what may China, mini, squeeze I shit and zanya, you been polar kuji Kenya, si you could end that but guess what? You know, blessings upon blessings, blessings upon so I don't know, monkeys, what's funny? No, 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 check out an history in a kubamba. I'm saying, Mina, check out your villa, look at my Kasrika Jay story. Aye, Yanni, not your visuri, Mina, the bag, I can do as a feature. I don't get Cossack, don't get you a two. You are talking feature to six months, he can go to that one. Utah, one of you know, some people, you know, some people can live a very private life, you know, if they then live it. That's the thing, she lives it. Aja <laughs> kutu zuletea vitu wapa. Tutayo um, nata six months ikifika. Wow. Yes. So, what are you trying to say? Yes, ah, hiyo nao. Huu ni kamatia rota. Hiyo hiyo siko. Hiyo wapana. 
Angegojea miezi sita tutajua tu. Come on, like But the the kiki around it is not necessary. It's not kiki. It's, it's not wrong. It's not kiki. Like, see, yeah. She has a huge following. So yeah. what's wrong with you just coming online to let your followers know, your people know, your fans know that you know what? We have a new member joining us very soon. Our family is growing. We are happy. What's wrong with that? Very soon, welcome to my YouTube channel. Thank you. Tunaenda tu hapa. Tutafika. Tutafika. Now, but we see most of, most of us start YouTube channels because as a means of survival. Of course, she doesn't need it. Come on. She doesn't need YouTube. So, you know, JC. That she, congratulations to her mm -hmm. now. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. She doesn't need YouTube. Mm -hmm. She has a company. She her mom has a company. She's a rich woman. And uh, this is this mm -hmm. is it. And a hardworking woman, not only yeah, yeah. to the throne. Yeah. She's hardworking. <laughs> and uh, Ben Paul, Nimsani. Yeah. Uh, Annelisa is more of a socialite, mm -hmm. less more of a socialite. Yeah. Nivile too, she, she's kind of private Corporate in a way. Socialite. Exactly. So, uh, if they don't keep, well, to keep up na Rusi. Sindio? Mm -hmm. Engagement, dating. Mbona wa situ wanyeshe? Arusi, they actually didn't tell us. Situ liona picha. Uh, Tulijua tu. Ku, is it? Eh. Yeah. Yeah. Kwa team master. Eh. Yeah. Lazima tutaziona tu. Sasa this is it. Mbona tusijue baby bump? Yeah. Why not? Sisi. If you've started it. Sini sisi tu wapa tunasamanga. Kama yeah. ulianza flow. You have to get as much. Sasa kikosa kunini kutuwanyesha baby bump. Leo tungiasema nini hapa? Deno, ata wewe yes, junasema yes, 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 yes. hivyo. Alafu, kidogo kidogo mmone na mtu. Mm. Alafu sema guy, ata alificha. Siya ketuambia tukile watu walikuwa na mbuki tamu. Nini? Nilinunua. You remember when Beyonce mm. didn't show her mm. first, uh, her, her first bump? Mm. When, like, I love all of a sudden she has a baby girl. Like, mm. it's not hard. She didn't even give mm. birth. That body didn't give birth. Yeah. See, nene, nene. You see, people always uh, like that. I love. I can imagine the excitement behind mm. it. You've you've been with a girl when you have the first baby bump. You know. When you excitement, you know, when you come back, you come back, you come and then here's another Do thing. You know that she just lost her sister, mm. so this is another good thing because you see, and it's a name of the sister care or something, something to give her mom. Some we never hate on babies. We never. Yeah. They are blessings because yeah. there are people out here who are asking God to give them one, yeah. at least one. Yeah. So congratulations to her, yeah. and we wish her all the best. A very mm. big, big, big. A feature kwa nini deno? Tu pe rizo. Wacha deno tu pe rizo. Moja ya ke kwa nini a feature? Unu alaji manga ya kenya sha, a kenya sha. Atarogo. Atarogo. Kurogo. Maumbi. No, no. Make it clear. Atarogo. Kuda mengo. Kuda mengo. Kuda mengo. Bye. You, you and you, you still live in that era. If you believe in it, it will happen. Anyway, anyway, let's move on to another one. At feeling doing on all socials, yes, at feeling doing. Do follow me if you have time. Yeah, at Jesse Mugore, at Dennis Bob Mina. Yeah, right. All right, now let's move on to another one where socialite come businesswoman Bridget Cheng shocked netizens earlier this week when she shared a video on her Instagram page accusing. Gospel singer Rington of taking advantage of her back in 2014. According to Bridget, Rington at the time did not care about being exposed by a nobody and even dared to report, even dared her rather to report to the police, which she actually did and at the at a Kilimani police station, but the case didn't go anywhere, just like the singer had told her. Now, in response, Rington made a video fat shaming her and telling her off uh, and telling people rather off who don't support him but never denied or confirmed the horrific NC dance. We have both videos. Let's have a look. Against my mouth. And true to his word, nothing happened. I went to Kilimani, nothing happened. That time Rington used to stay in Westland. And he used to take, and I, I stand and I tell all women who, any man has taken advantage of, we are going to stand for ourselves. We are going to stand for our rights. Women go through so much even in this country, and they cannot go out there just because they are told you don't have power to do anything. It is so sad. Kuna wajinga hapo wanashinda wanaongea ongea hapo Hey stupid kujo ukalala ewe Na mstaje china ya chairman ovi ovi ewe Chairman ni chairman bana Mini kijana wa mungu ewe Na mimi wacha nuambia ukweli Siku hapa kwa sababu ya support yenyu Nyi muna jua wale mmekua muki support Liku wangusha wame wangusha Mimi niku hapa kwa sababu ya support ya mungu mwenyewe Mimi siku hapa kwa sababu ni najua kuimba Mmmmm Wale wakona sauti nzuri muna wajua hapo inje bana. Mimi. 
<laughs> All right. Wow. So that's a lot. That's actually a lot. Mm -hmm. It's too so much to handle. JC. It's too much. Yeah, Bridget. Mm -hmm. Um. You see, okay. Let me wow. before you even talk. <laughs> there was um when she came out. Yeah. A lot of guys were like, "Why is she coming out just now? Why didn't she speak then?" She said she did. No one was listening. Right now, at least she has a platform. She can speak about it. We see Adi Maju, unonangazile hashtag me too. When one person stands up and says so and so, this director mm -hmm. took advantage mm -hmm. of me. And then you're like, oh, even you. And then it's a whole group of women, more than 200. They're like, oh, he did that to me too. Oh, he did that to me. You see? And it's the same case. Uh, uh, not the mm -hmm. same case with Rington, but we've had such allegations uh, said against him before. before you remember uh, exposed Ilea extendella mm. there was a time he was mm. exposed there alongside ken gomeri gomeri mm. yeah and it was really really nasty it was bad it went because, it, it yeah. bias, so, well, mm. in high schools mm. and they used to take advantage mm. of girls back then it never went anywhere it is still allegedly we still cannot confirm that but then now we have another person speaking up right now what are your thoughts one thing I I sincerely hope and I know of women who have been sexually assaulted before. They just don't come up and frame a victim. And uh, what I will tell people is that you don't understand that person, Mwenyame Assaulty, or the woman who has been assaulted before, until she speaks up. Do you know there are people who can, they have never even spoken up about being raped? Yeah. That is it. They'll speak up at one, t at one point and then you're like, what? And then they will never That's talk it. about it. They want to see your reaction. And, I, uh, judge hey, you. and Bridget saying from the point of view that she was not famous. She never had a platform. Hakuna kitu angefanya. Si alikuwa kwa ya girl that time wachacha. Na umetrust msani. And then now, like, like, like uh, Saiju akona platform ya kuongea. When she speaks, tunanza kumuandress na kumkata because she's simply a socialite. Yeah. Because of her lifestyle. Mm -hmm. uh, it, that hasn't changed her that she's a woman. Yeah. It hasn't changed the fact that if she was assaulted, Haija change anything about it. Yeah. The person who assaulted her, Hajapata, what he deserves. There is nobody who has assaulted a woman and a fuck who understand with the other normal people. Yeah. We say women are not objects. Now, una, una, una realize kwa comments zake what people are saying. You're like, what? You will, you will, you, you never figure it out. I will wake up one day feeling nani chukwe video, ni, nani na joe ni kwa na, na following over 100k people. And they yeah. start saying at ECG, flani na flani, alini re. Mm. And even cry. And Baka ni pate machozi. Yeah. And if you could tell the face Yarrington on that video, he was tense. Yeah. And he never touched on that response. Hakum respondia. Alianza kusema mambo ya magari zake, na nyumba zake. Pesa yake. Yeah, you guys he never me. talked about it. Yeah. Na kasema ye ni mungu wake. Na sijui nini nini nini. Yeah. Na kama mtu kana kwanza fat shaming. Izo ni question mark. Exactly. Ngombe, hey. Who does sijui. that? Wow. That was hey. really. You're going cool. even too extra. But You're even trying. at the same time. Hey. I sort of understand him because it's not something. You see that taints his image. Yeah. It's not something like you take lightly. Like, wait, wait. In case like let's say. um God forbid. I say like. You <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. You killed. And then someone is like. Yeah. <laughs> you're a murderer. Of course you won't take it lightly. Like, yeah. At a time you quail you'll be like. Kwa nini unasema? That is, how, that is the uh, human yeah, nature. Yeah, yeah, Reaction yeah. to your kwanza. Uh, defensive at some point. So I don't know what Dennis has to say. But at the same time, can we like stop? Um, now we have, we are at a point that at Bridget to not like, uh, approve. Like how do you know approve it Ajay? And, you know, Ni, like, it was between her and him. Like, yeah, yeah. So, like, let's Ni, nini that, like questioning what? How, like, Ati how it happened. How did that even Proof. happen? How did you know? Proof. Like, Proof yeah. in a kwanga to kwa lab. Like, Ati, how, how do we even know it happened? But that's a woman's perspective perspective so let's hear it from mangas unakwambia ana nyongo hapa ana sketch huku yeah and he's like ana gongesha hadi miguu apo na tension na radio honestly hold it actually the thing is events of last week have taught me a lot a lot uh in matters of somebody said somebody did for me and this and this i am not engaging kindly in the lane now you know one point that actually got point and said uh, this is wrong 
is the response that Rington decided to give. Mm. There was a better way of addressing your allegations, and uh, that was not the right way. Mm. So these matters are kind of sensitive, and I'll tell you for free. Mm. You guys are telling me for free. Answering that such questions or being on this panel and on this side of the boy child fraternity is kind of tough to answer such questions. So I'll not answer. Thank you. <laughs> there are no questions. You were supposed no, to is, comment. Is, the comments uh, they, they, they are becoming and, too sensitive. Okay, I understand. Unadzua, it's not because of Akina Shafi. He it's, had a different thing to say. It's a very sensitive But he, 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 he was too different. Say, this is a rape allegation. Ile ingine ni clout. You get. Oh. But then he's like, I cannot say it's cloud because people are going to judge You just tell me. us no, what you think. Opinion. It's your opinion here. Nobody's judging you, bruh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. is judging thank you let's proceed all right cool now hey. on to the next one the hashtag is chit chat and i'm so sorry we came i and i'm talking about what i call on the show 7 p.m we are so sorry <laughs> we are so sorry Pass anyway you. so <laughs> if you're just catching us halfway don't worry we have a repeat right mm. anyway now nike is suing the art collective behind the lil mars are uh, certain shoes in court that have sparked a social <laughs> media backlash in a lawsuit filed on a Monday? Nike accuses MSH, uh, M MSCHF product studio in cooperation of trademark infringement over the designer's 666 pairs of modified Nike sneakers made in collaboration with the Montero singer. All 666 pairs sold out on Monday in under one minute. Now, MSCHF has not responded to repeated requests for comment about the lawsuit. All right. For those of you who don't understand, you know Lil Nas. Mm. Um, okay, but really, I I I need to make Lil Nas. I could wear Old Town. Il go Old Town. Oh, I'm gonna take my, my horse to the Old Town Road. I'm gonna ride till I can you know, no right, more. You know, right? You know. That's how we use. Yeah, need to live with Ivo. I love to get down. I could tell Montero we're like, hey, I know, right? Hey, hey, bruh. 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 And I wear it so tiny. But then so after that, I kinda Nike sino to the mm. Nike. So I'm in a call. Aka like Utoke Nike when the corporation in Guinea one be you know what? Nataka is via to stand in his So the way those shoes were made, the metang is the metang is one satanic signs and laugh what is the make six six. Yeah, the make was six six six. I love what is it? Is it gonna dump me? A drop, a drop of someone's of blood. Of human blood. These are the shoes that have look uh, something, a, a vase. Yeah, they are black yeah. and they have well, a red thing yeah. here. Yeah. There is a vase actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Look, look something. Look, look something. Yeah, so there is mm. that. Okay, so, so and then sort of fall mm. from. Kwa uh, box yeah. yake, yeah. there's um. Kuna Yesu na kuna shetani. Like there's a lot of blasphemy. If you believe it's in God, it's too much. Like there's a lot of. It's too much for us Christians to handle. I don't know. But then Christians have been receiving a lot of hate in social media as well. They're like, y'all are hypocrites, so why are you coming for him though? So the same company that made these shoes, so katanginiza za white, zenya zina anything, ziko jine yo, hizo tuvileto ziko hivo, alafu wa meka John 316, wakasema kama ni Christian basi nunueni hizi zingine. Ah, say yoni madharao. You know, wa meka John 316. John 316. For God's all of the world. He's only begotten son. As a shuwa ni. I know. I know. Mine. <laughs> so, I don't
I don't. Wewe <laughs> mchukue mimi simtaki. Juu at the end of the day ataingia uzia ati atatoa masiriza huko atuletee juu ya bila me transform. <laughs> eh, so we get. Nimesikia mmesema ndio mjamaa. Ndini mbaya mpaka eh. Yes, go, 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 to go, we do not want go to heaven. Ah, pana hata ku hell. <laughs> go to heaven. So you can imagine what he is like. But girl, um, but that was a lot, though, right? Yeah, I think uh, the same way we respect other people's uh, yeah. religion. Well, his it's art. Iyo According to him, and it's my uni art. Like one of kila ni normal. Human blood. Damu ni anani metolewa. Iweko kuakiatu. But when they say there is human blood, be sure there is. No, but it's true. They this one, he, 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 he don't only zanani metolevo. Sasa, it's bad. Ah, uh, for us, me as a believer, uh, mm -mm, mm -mm. Mm -mm. at a old town, ni may delete officially kwa ni ni music. Ni me ni delete owo. Okay. To me to a me. I even unsubscribed. I even unsubscribed. To Jamaliza na wala watu na ingia kinyo manu ma unatoa viatu zuko na damu yani ni umse wa chana. Damu surely. What are now Christians? That's not even the scariest thing. So I need to all six hundred and sixty-six pairs. Mm -hmm. The the first one ilikuwa mm. yake officially so they've sold 600 they sold 665 pairs mm. of that now Nike banned them from producing more Kwanza si walisema yeye they are not affiliated eh yeah. so wakamruka they sold under 1 minute cuz what people are coming for Nike like you may look together via to gun easy Nike are like yo that's not us bra like because they buy bra the brand you know wanna buy brand so that's the thing though people bought it in under a minute We have the only people outside Zisha Isha like you can't buy cuz they were they were so <laughs> you guys are here like oh they are evil they Nani kuuliza ni nini amefanya macho squeeze ni nini amefanya macho I don't know like But nafikiri akona I think akona ile kiki ya nakumbuka ile kiki tulikuwa na tukiwa high school ile tulikuwa tunaambia ati umbrella ya Rihana ukifanya hivi ina ina for mingi 666 mnakumbuka hizo maji I think I saw your stage at So you know he's very young So let's hope by the time anafika age ya kina Riri na Beyonce tutakuwa tumejua his true colors But he is I think he's trying to find his way in the industry he doesn't know which way to go Hiyo ni kiki ya majuu lakini ya majuu ni ngumu kutengeneza shaki yatu huku kwetu tu tunatokanga kwa social media unachukua video tuna tunakuongelea yeye adwetengeleza viatu na atoe wimbo na na ameweka look up kwa kiatu bado kuna bible verse hey, that is too much you are gonna fans because people think he is artistic and anyway, we do not judge maybe it's just a way of expressing himself he's not an artist mm. just who you are so can you have Ah, kwani tunamjudge. Hatumjudge. We won't judge you. I won't judge you. I won't judge you. Kaza na kwa mjanga tujudge, hapo ndo wanakujudge vizuri. It's so much fun guys. Uh, shout out to Edgar Hansen when you're on Facebook. Thank you so much. Uh, Karis Bobake Chris watching from Gong Rice Cause. A big shout out to you. Robert Keep Kurui. Uh, hello Captel Tupo watching. A big shout out to you. Keep Tom Tiso watching from Mach Chakos. Hi. I love I have Manu Wafula and I say hey, hi Manu ni aje kofiti. Thank you for watching. Y'all have shout outs before we go home. Ah, uh, mimi nitafunga na mbogi yangu ya mtaani mzee fungeni mwende mta ni kubaya. It is a few minutes to rush out. Na hii si ya mchezo. Viboko ziko standby. So anyway, na watu walisema tusipigwe by the way. Apparently there is a directive against that. So watu wasitoa. Hatutandikwi. Lakini lakini wa Kenya squad hatupigwi. Lakini wa Kenya oboko ni dawa. Tulizoea kutoka primary to red stick. <laughs> so anyway ladies and gentlemen to endelea na moyo wangu tusikimbizane na serikali yeah, let me tell you something when you you said a very bad thing because una na wana tu kule kwa nyewe unaoka kwenye ume cha mbosho unaenda kwa nyewe umepita hapo mimi ndakula tu ndapigwa nyewe hata nikikosa hata nikula lakini mams walikuwa na detector juu umekula kwa nyewe na umekunywa hadi maji So uh, guys thank you so much for tuning in uh, Judy kama kawaida Lilian leo tuko na a new viewer mm. hey, atusame kiafi ni mzuri lakini hako nyumbani because of circumstances <laughs> 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 thank you so much uh, yeah. and uh, yeah I'm Jacinta Mugore face I'm um, Jacinta Mugore Facebook mm -hmm. Jacinta Mugore Instagram Magrimish. and Mugore Moresho on Twitter yeah right. and uh, thank you so much Aki tunawa appreciate sana sana and at feeling June 
Kila Mahali on Facebook, on Instagram, and on Twitter as well. A big shout out to everybody that made the show possible. Mm -hmm. We have uh, Maurice right here on the camera. We have Millicent. There is Hillary. There is Rose. Hey, yep. There is Rose. We call you. A big shout out to you. Any tsume to Kila Mtu? Dennis, no, no, Kiyashua. What do you have to say? Mimi, na sem, wewe ni kafu na niwasha. What do I end up? I'm being Maurice. Maurice, do my camera. When I wash one and kafu, and they are essential workers. They keep forgetting that. Welcome to the Explain when you think you want. We're going to be standing on a stick. Anyway, guys, it's been so much fun. We're going to see you again next week. Enjoy your weekend. Bye. See ya.